Just another windy day, huh? my indoor plants now. Yep, there we go, in here. It's good because I have a lot of plants and a lot of windows. So, what I have here, two strawberry plants. Uh, no runner, these were runners that of my old plants that died. Before they died, they runnered, and then what do I got? Strawberry plants. Put those. This is romaine lettuce seedlings. Need sunlight. They're getting leggy. Here's a wild strawberry plant I found, and I put a runner in this, and then I put a mint thing in here, and I'm gonna root it in there and cut it off because I got a big mint plant I had bought from Walmart. Tomatoes I've picked. Yeah. It 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 could just stay there. Yeah. Here's some onion bulbs. I found these weren't even at the grocery store. These were laying in my uh my cousin's garden and she didn't want them anymore. So now I'm gonna plant those somewhere. And I got a strawberry, another strawberry. It needs some fertilizer, or it needs some nutrients. It doesn't need fertilizer. Garlic. Down, there's roots down there. And there's a rotten spot, though. I'm kind of worried about that. Maple tree. It's starting to die a little bit. I'm worried about it. Another maple tree. A strawberry seedling in that pot. And more apple trees back there and uh, an iceberg lettuce sprout. So that's inside and if ever, um, during the winter I'm going to have this grow light and I'm also going to have a heating lamp. How? Well there's the outlets but there's no electricity in here so we're going to use an extension cord from that pole back there. And you're probably not going to hear me half this time. Um, I also got a trellis in there, say if I want to grow a vining plant, then I got a trellis. Okay, my garden is weeds. Um, you wonder what, we're getting a good harvest off of it, uh, regardless. Clipping right here, and it grew. Weeds. How about 
about that. I love weeds. And it is gusting like 40 mile an hour sometimes. Um, yeah, look at down there. We got some tomatoes. This this fell over. The weight of the tomatoes and um the wind blew the cage over. And but it didn't snap, I'm surprised. This is what Praxis means when he says don't cage your tomatoes, because if anything bad would have happened, it would have snapped the plant. So, sometimes you just gotta listen to them. Uh, cucumbers are dead. We killed, or I killed the last plant that was alive. They were getting strangled by weeds. Then I just killed them. Cantaloupe. Uh, Pumpkin running through the garden again. Pumpkin gone wild. Yeah, pumpkin gone wild. More like pumpkin. One vine died off of it, and now it's only now it's starting to get more vines. Again, are dead. Um, but zucchini, we got a tiny one down there that are just recovering from all that summertime heat. Uh, pumpkins, once again. Um, more pumpkins. A gourd. A young pumpkin. Yeah, and these were even, these were volunteer pumpkins, too. They came back from last year. Well, the seeds, uh, sprouted from last year, after the pumpkin rotted. I gotta talk loud to them. Um, more stuff. I can't even identify some of the squash anymore. Um, this is zucchini for sure. Um, because you can tell, we got a female flower right here, and it's a long one. Up oh, and my tomatillo plant's dead. Don't, don't worry about them anymore. Volunteer tomato plant right here. It's, it's an heirloom, too. So it's growing true from seed. And then what do I got here? I started weeding. How about that? And I found this again. I found another volunteer tomato, and it has a tomato on it. Yep. Just more weeds. God. My life is ruined now. Because of weeds. Um, in a little bit now, um, if I do my garden again, I'm going to, um, probably have lettuce sprouts or something, herb sprouts. Uh, yeah, because we're going to start herbs now. No! Little squash to- oh. Hi, squash. This is a squash plant that grew out in the cornfield. I dug it up, and I brought it back here. I never showed it in my other videos, um, because I didn't think about it. Um, strawberries, I remember with my first and second update, I had strawberries. Oh wow, there's my topsy turvy. Yeah. Uh oh. Well, this topsy turvy's a piece of crap now. See that? Topsy turvy is now a piece of crap. Look at this. It just tears right apart. Look, just watch it. Blow away in the wind! There's nothing but a piece of crap now. Um, let me 
me try to find my other planter. There you are. At least I got this planter. Um, I used to have, wow, I'm making this really long. I used to have strawberry plants in here, but there's just weeds that I pulled. Yeah, so that's great. ran over the fence back here. The mower. Um, here we go. Spade. Thank you for finding it. So, yeah, that's just how everything's starting to grow. And it's been raining for the past few days. It's nice and uh, windy now to dry it all up. Oh yeah, how about showing more tomatoes? Um, yeah, look at all. They're getting white, but you can see some reds in there. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Uh, yeah, there's some good tomatoes. I know I didn't do much on the tomato, so bye. Oh, never mind. I still got like a few more seconds. Yeah. Here's what it looks like from my little village plant outside the windows.